Introduction to Cybersecurity Analysis, Part 1. The U.S. Department of Defense has an array of policies related to cybersecurity in the form of issuances, directives, and standards. The Departments of Defense, Homeland Security, and Transportation have formed an aviation cyber initiative to provide a forum to advance cyber research and development and test and evaluation efforts. Public and private funding for cyber research is on the rise to understand the resiliency of systems to cyber threats. This is critical for military aircraft and important for ships and ground vehicles as well. Legacy embedded systems pose unique challenges for cybersecurity, especially systems using MIL Standard 1553, which is a multiplex data bus communication protocol. 1553 protocol continues to be the most prevalent military data bus. It's on practically every Air Force aircraft platform for weapons, electronic warfare, and avionics, as well as Army and Navy vehicles and ships. MIL Standard 1553 is deterministic, fault-tolerant, and time-tested, but the standard hasn't been revised since 1978. It clearly was not designed to address contemporary cybersecurity issues, and as such, it's a potential entry point for cyber threats. So, test and evaluation is required to characterize vulnerabilities in 1553 connected systems. And Alta Data provides powerful analysis tools to characterize the cyber behavior of 1553 architectures. Alta Data Software Suite consists of three tools Alta API for development, Alta View for simulation and analysis, and Alta RTVAL for remote terminal validation all made possible by the advanced AltaCore firmware protocol engine. In part two, I'll cover how Alta's powerful analysis tools can be used for cyber intrusion analysis. Want to know more? We're happy to help.